is a podcast with Trevor Ron and Barista Brian yes. and Jess. Hi, it was so much fun. We talked to Trevor about everything. We talked to him about exposing X Factor. We talked to him about sex, his Tinder account. We talked to him about everything. Wait, I then, didn't realize we were talking about that. <laughs> yeah, we did. And then Brian made us frappuccinos. They were everything. Pumpkin spice. We have pumpkin spice foods. It's honestly such a good episode, and you guys need to go listen. SoundCloud.com slash Shane and Friends, and I'll put the links down there for the full screen app. Are you excited? Yeah! Oh, that's super <laughs> Hey, what's up, you guys? Yes. First of all, I just want to say, I was so excited about this video, because I was like, damn, you know what? I'm going to do a video about crazy celebrity favorite foods. I want some bougie, fancy, weird-ass shit. I want to fly in food from, like, other countries. I want to go to a fancy-ass restaurant in my fucking gross-ass shirt, my fucking gym shorts, and my not-washed hair, and say, hi, I'll take the most expensive thing on the menu. And when they look at me and say, uh, you can't afford it, I'll be like, bitch, I'm famous. And then they'll say, bitch, who? Like, who are you, bitch? You are a homeless gay person wearing a shirt that is promoting a fucking trampoline park. Get out. <laughs> and you're wearing shoes with zippers on them. I'm actually wearing shoes that have a fucking zipper because I'm that lazy. So then I went on the internet and I was like, what are celebrities' favorite foods? And then when I found it, I was like, the fuck? Celebrities are trashier than us. And that's coming from me, Trash King. Fucking when I walk through the door, like everybody like hails to the trash king. They throw banana peels at him. They give him a crown made out of dog poop bags. And even I would not go this far in the trashiness department. So if you thought this video was gonna be delicious, you thought wrong. All right, I'm gonna start with Kylie Jenner. Where do I start? No, I'm not gonna read the bitch. I'm gonna eat the bitch. Me, if I was in a porn about librarians. Okay, so this is a special concoction that Kylie Jenner tweeted about, Instagrammed about, Snapchatted about. She was so proud of this that she needed to tell the whole world. This is the cup noodles, which by the way, it's always been cup o noodles. Mandela effect, bitch. And then she puts garlic powder, butter, and a whole egg. And then she heats it up and it makes this. I'm gonna be honest, I haven't had a cup of noodles since I was on welfare, so like just the smell of it is taking me back. Like if I hear a door knock, I'm hiding under my bed, I'm saying, Mom, they're here! No, oh, you know, just little things that happen when you don't pay your bills. But I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually very intrigued. Let me show you what this looks like. You can see the egg, you can see the noodles, you can see the heartbreak. <laughs> from the people who eat this on a daily basis. Like, this is not a food that people are like, damn, I want a cup of noodles right now. This is a food where people are like, damn, we have a cup of noodles right now? All right, okay. Mom, is dad ever coming home? No? Okay. Does God exist? Mama, why are you laughing? Like, that's how dark life gets when you eat this. <laughs> All right, so let's take a bite. Oh my God, by the way, that would be the worst, like, <laughs> Hashtag spots. Cup of noodles. Wanna kill yourself? <laughs> oh, just grab a cup. All right, here we go. Take a big old spicy bite. Oh, I cannot imagine Kylie eating this. I also can't imagine Kylie shitting. Like, I can imagine everybody shitting, but the thought of her shitting is confusing to me. Like, where does it come out of? Like, that mouth is an asshole. You know what I mean? That's a gaping booty hole if I've ever seen one. Let's take a bite. Okay, so I now believe that Kylie has never had any lip injections. I think all the sodium and salt from the shit she's eating is just going to her face. Cause this is the saltiest thing I've ever had. How do Kardashians eat this? I don't understand. I see pictures, they're all skinny with big asses, big faces, <laughs> but they all have fucking abs. Like if I were to eat this, you know, I would have a big ass, a big face and a big ass stomach. So basically me right now. <laughs> also their logo is much more than a suit. Yeah, bitch. It's a cry for help. <laughs> it's a suicide note. <laughs> All right, next food. All right, this next bitch. <laughs> this next bitch needs to get kicked out of Hollywood for what she just made. This is Jennifer Lawrence's favorite food. A pizza spaghetti chili sandwich. Bitch, you want an Oscar? I hope that Oscar is right next to your toilet so you can see it all the time because there's no way you are not in the bathroom 24 seven when you are eating this. I think she's lying. I think this is her trying to be relatable because she's like, you know, rich and famous and trying to relate to us commoners. All right, here we go. We are going to try this. Do I pick it up like a sandwich? I don't know how to do this. Jennifer, help. Okay, here we go. Oh God. Oh. <laughs> This looks like some heavyweight shit. You ever seen that movie? Where all those fat kids are combining all the foods and fucking making big old weird cakes out of candy. Wait, ooh, you got the Peeps, you got the Sprees, whatever the fuck those were. You got the M&Ms, you got Gladys. I bet you got it all. I am heavyweights, Mandela effect. All right, here we go. Let's take a bite. Oh. 
fuck. <laughs> fuck! Oh, Jennifer. Oh my god, listen, Jennifer. I didn't see Joy, because I didn't relate to the title. But bitch, this is giving me so much joy. I didn't see American Hustle, but this is gonna make me hustle to the toilet <laughs> to get rid of it. This is going to destroy my ass. My ass is gonna win an Oscar for best dramatic performance. <laughs> there will be tears, bitch. This is crazy. It's so good though. It's like, oh, the pizza is like crunchy. This is pizza, Hut, by the way. And then the spaghetti uh, is like slimy. That's Chef Boyardee, by the way. And then I got this chili. I don't even know where I got that chili. I don't know, whatever. All of it together make this fucking beautiful, gross mess. That's my perfume line. And it smells like this. Uh, good job, Jennifer. God, why are you so fucking perfect? Oh my God, I'm so mad at Jennifer. Who am I? Shailene Woodley. I'm just kidding. I don't even know who that really is. <laughs> Let's try to start beef. Okay, next food. Also, really quick, I know, I look really bad today, uh, every day. But today especially, because they fucking turned off my water heater for some reason, so I couldn't take a shower. God, I'm so famous. Okay, next food. Okay, so next we have two foods for one celebrity. And that celebrity is Selena Gomez. Now, her first favorite food out of all foods in the world is fucking pickles. Now, you know how I feel about pickles. Now listen, I am not gonna drag a bitch with lupus. <laughs> she has gone through too much. She is currently in rehab, so I'm not going to drag the bitch. But pickles, listen, when you get out of rehab, when you're all fresh-minded and like ready to conquer the world, step one, talk to your friends and family and apologize for all the things you've done wrong. Step two, find a higher power and worship him. Step three, get rid of all the people in your life that have drugs around you. Step four, throw away the fucking jar of pickles, bitch! Cause nobody wants them, Selena. I would rather you do drugs. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> then eat pickles. Also, I hate this bird. I hate that they're a fucking mascot. He's scary. Look at him with that big ass beak and that fucking creepy ass hat. I don't trust him. All right, let's try one of these. I mean, I know what they taste like. Not good. Oh, it's a sound of defeat. Oh, the fucking smell. Oh. Oh my God. Okay, here we go. All right. All right, we're gonna. Pull out this, that's a big fucking pickle. That's a huge pickle, why is it so big? The girthiness of this pickle, <laughs> I'm relating to a lot. All right, here we go, let's take a big old bite. Ah, 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 ah. Ah, no surprise, I fucking hate it. I had this girl in my class. God, I don't remember her name, nobody did. She was one of those creepy girls that would like draw on her notebook and then when the teacher would be like, let me see that, it would just be a picture of the teacher gutted. She was that girl who would get called to the office like five times a day because of a family emergency and then she'd come back with like a little bit of blood on her shirt, really confusing. Well, she would come to school every day with a jar of pickle juice and a straw. And you know what happened to that girl? I don't know. No one does. Because nobody looks her up. Because she was fucking creepy. So, next food. Now this Selena is right for. I have never heard of this combination before. This girl loves to combine corn dogs and syrup. I've never thought about that, but that's fucking genius. Cause corn dogs are like sweet because it's like cornbread. And then you got the syrup, which is sweet, like it's a pancake. Oh yeah. Selena, when you get out of rehab, you need to open up a restaurant. Maybe that's what she should do. Maybe that's her next career move. Also, on a side note, I know I'm making a lot of jokes about it, but rehab is something we shouldn't really joke about. <laughs> As I'm making jokes about it. But um, I think it takes a lot of strength and courage to actually go to rehab, especially when you're famous, because everybody knows that you're doing it. And you know, I don't know, more power to her. I've always liked Selena, but let's continue to drag the bitch. Okay, so let's try this. I got Mrs. Buttersworth because I love seeing the syrup come out of her stupid fucking head. And I love the thought of her screaming as it happens. So you know what, let's actually take the top off. I wanna see her guts really pour out. Okay, here we go. Oh my God! Oh my God, I have a family! Oh, I'm Brandon. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Hello? Oh, I can't use my brain anymore. <laughs> oh, I love murder. Sweet, sweet murder. All right, so now let's take this corn doll and dunk it in this huge cup full of syrup. This is my fucking dream come true. That and Honey Boo Boo becoming a pop star. I just want to see that. All right, here we go. Oh my God. Oh my God, you see that? You see how she is just dumped. All right, one, two, three. Oh my God, <gasps> that was beautiful. Oh my God, oh my God, I'm fucking ready for this. Okay, you guys ready for this? Oh my God, oh my God. Oh, Justin, what the fuck is wrong with you? Why would you leave this girl? She's dipping corn dogs in maple syrup. You know what that means? Bitch is crazy. 
Oh, bitch is a crazy genius. Cause this is amazing. Oh my God, just imagine. Like what other crazy shit she could come up with? Now something tells me she created this under the influence of a lot of weed. <laughs> And I am here for it. Weed's legal now. Selena, keep smoking it and keep coming up with these concoctions. Oh my God. Oh, this is amazing. And something about it just feels real good. Like I just love dipping, 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 dripping, <gasps> sipping. <laughs> Wait, bitch you tripping, bitch you dripping, bitch you slipping, bitch you sipping. Uh, one day I'm gonna run out of catchphrases. Nah, I'm just kidding. Bitch you chipping. <laughs> Oh, it never ends. All right, now this next food is very confusing. This is Channing Tatum's favorite food, which like you would think would be something really healthy, something like organic. Like he's always taking his shirt off, he's always stripping. Oh, bitch, you stripping? They never fucking end. But this food supposedly is his favorite and it's fucked. This is a peanut butter and jelly sandwich with Cheetos in it. Huh. Now Channing, I'm all about combining weird ass foods. I'm all about being gross, but this is too far. The texture of bread mixed with peanut butter and jelly mixed with Cheeto. That's almost as gross as me starring in Magic Mike. Don't think about it. All right, let's cut into this witch. <laughs> Bitch, you witching? No, doesn't work. All right, let's see if we can, oh, oh, the sound, oh. All right, here we go. Oh my God, oh, uh, <laughs> uh, oh no. <laughs> Why? All right, here we go. Why is that good? <laughs> I'm confused. It's so good. Oh my God. Uh, for some reason, the combination of flavors like fucking kills it. The crunchiness of the Cheeto for some reason works with this sandwich. It tastes like a sweet, salty, just fucking miracle. Why, Channing? What the fuck is wrong with you? Why are you such a genius? Like I knew Channing was crazy. I saw him randomly in public and he was dressed in a vest, a top hat and clown shoes. And he was not working. He was just working. And I was like, oh damn, that motherfucker's crazy. But then I tasted this and I'm like, motherfucker is a crazy genius. Oh my God. Can you imagine, oh, if I toasted this? Bitch, you toasted. Oh, or I put this like in the microwave for just like a few seconds and let it all like melt together. Fuck. Selena, hurry, get out of rehab, bitch. You gonna love this. <laughs> I'll be waiting at the exit door for you with this. All right, let's move on before I fuck that sandwich. Okay, before I get to a really weird one, I'm gonna go through two of these very fast. First, Justin Bieber's favorite food is spaghetti bolognese. I don't know how to pronounce that, but I think it means spaghetti meatballs, and I don't need to try this. Like, I know what this is gonna taste like. But I also feel like Justin is lying. I feel like Justin, like, hunts zebras. Or like, honestly, unicorns. Like, he finds animals that, like, we didn't even know fucking existed. And then he hunts them for fun, chops off their fucking heads, takes their blood and like makes syrup out of it. And then like eats the whole animal with his boys. Like something bougie and weird. Not fucking spaghetti. I don't believe it. And then the second food I'm gonna do real quick is Ed Sheeran's favorite, which is motherfucking fish sticks. <laughs> Listen, Ed, I love you. I, for some reason, want to fuck you. But you know who doesn't want to fuck you? Taylor Swift. And you know why she doesn't want to fuck you? Cause you eat fish sticks, bitch! Who does that? Fish sticks, when you're rich. Like, fish sticks are in the cup of noodles category. Like, this is the last fucking option. Like, it's either a fish stick or you're eating that cockroach under your mama's high heel. Like, that's how fucking low in life you gotta be to be like, damn, fish sticks. Like, when I bought these at Ralph's, the woman checking me out said, oh, here. I have extra coupons. Oh, and extra Ralph's cards. And oh, here's my number if you ever just need to talk. She practically started a charity for me. But that being said, I fucking love this chicks. <laughs> oh, they're so good. <laughs> Okay, last but not least, this is crazy. Mariah Carey does something called the purple diet where she only eats purple foods. So I Googled it and most purple foods are like fruits, vegetables, things that I don't wanna eat. And then I found a little bit of a loophole. Staff, what's for dinner? Oh, Miss Mariah, we have eggplants and grapes. Hmm, I think I'm gonna have a Big Mac. Oh uh, man, that's not purple. It is now, bitch. Yes, the perfect diet. Just spray everything purple. I mean, this burger is so healthy, so luxurious, and since it's purple, I'm guaranteed to lose weight, just like Mariah. <laughs> and I know you're thinking, Shane, only an actual crazy person would eat that. Well, me and Mariah. <laughs> just two crazy bitches with disorders. Oh. The extra chemicals just make it even better. Well, there you guys go. Hopefully you enjoyed watching me eat weird celebrity favorite foods and galaxy my hands, which I will never get off because I can't shower. Once again, I'm very famous. All right, you guys, if you want me to do more celebrity food videos, give me a thumbs up so I know. And subscribe to my channel right down below because I make new videos every day. And if you want to see other videos of me trying really expensive foods or famous Instagram foods or other random foods, I'll put a link to a playlist right at the top of the description below. All right, you purple Big Macs, I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.
Okay, me when I look at my hate comments. Okay, but actually fucking me. 20% off. Well, that's sad. Okay, when you post that hottest fucking pictures of you in that sexy ass dress and all your haters are like, 